An offer is on the table to reopen this emergency department. It's a move that some say could save lives and in some cases drastically cut down on response time. For two years, the northern part of Greenville County has not had a designated emergency room. Last year, Prisma Health opened a walk-in care clinic in what used to be the ER. This is something that we've been working on for a long time. Ever since they closed the emergency room, we've been trying to get it back. County Councilman Joe Dill and State Representative Mike Burns say response time has been the main concern. So up here, if it takes 40 minutes to get an ambulance to you, and then 40 minutes to get you downtown to an ER, you're in trouble. In a new statement, Prisma Health says it is willing to work with the county to bring back the emergency department. In part, quote, we have shared a plan with the county which would accomplish this goal and we are prepared to move forward upon their approval. The cost is not clear. Dill says he believes the county could use federal COVID funds. What we're talking about here is lives. If, if we save one life, it'd be worth all of what it's going to take to do this. Chairman Willis Meadows says the county has also been in talks with Bon Secours St. Francis. That is a real need in, in that area of the county. We've been working with, uh, with Prisma and also with Bon Secours is to see what can be done that will maybe open up an emergency room there. But nothing has been settled or, or has, has been decided at this time. I'm going to be standing with either group that comes and any if a third party comes in. You know, we're big enough up here now. If we had two emergency rooms, I'd be standing with both groups. But we need one now desperately. It's not clear when or if council could take action on this proposal. In Traveler's Rest, Taggart Houck, WYFF News 4.